Speed matters. Nearly half of web users expect sites to load in two seconds or less, and 40% will leave a site if it hasn't loaded within three seconds. And on top of lost traffic, slow pages can even lead to a reduction in your search engine rankings. In this guide, I'll explain what you can do to boost your website's performance and optimize it for quick load times. There's a lot to cover, so let's get started. First, here are two free tools you can use to test your website speed. Repeat these tests multiple times to get a more accurate result. It's also smart to run these tests regularly. New factors can affect your site and slow it down unexpectedly, so you'll always need to keep up to date with its performance. The first option is Pingdom Tools. This site retrieves your pages from a specific location and returns information about how quickly they loaded. Plus, Pingdom Tools rates your site based on several metrics and shows how your site's speed compares to others. The second option is GT Metrics. Along with free speed checking, it also provides more in-depth metrics and even offers optimization suggestions based on your results. Once the test concludes, you'll get access to a lot of data. Armed with that info, it's finally time to see how you can make your site faster. Number one, choose a quality hosting plan. This is the most important choice you'll make for your website. When a user visits your site, your host server will determine how quickly information is passed to them. Basically, even if you optimize your site for speed, it won't make much difference if your server is slow or your hosting plan is inadequate. For this reason, it's crucial to pick a hosting provider and plan that suits your specific requirements. If you're in the market for a managed WordPress hosting service, DreamPress provides faster SSD-based storage and other built-in speed optimization solutions such as caching plugins. Using managed hosting also makes it much easier to expand and scale your site over time. Number two, always keep your WordPress software updated. Whether they're core updates for your WordPress install or new versions of your WordPress theme or plugins, it's essential that they aren't ignored. The most important reason for this is security. However, Keeping your site updated will also ensure that it stays as fast as possible. You should also make sure your site uses the latest version of PHP. This speeds up your site considerably and makes sure it has full compatibility with WordPress. If you have a managed hosting plan with DreamHost, you have access to PHP's most recent version. Plus, your site will be automatically updated whenever a new version of WordPress is ready. Number three. Use caching. The easiest way to understand caching is to think of it as a site's short-term memory. When a site is accessed for the first time, a copy of all requested files are saved. These cached files are then displayed the next time the same site is visited. This makes sure your website's files don't have to be requested and loaded directly from the server every time somebody visits it. Caching significantly cuts down on the resources required to run your site, which can speed it up considerably. Caching may sound pretty technical, but it's actually easy to implement on a WordPress site. You can use several plugins to do this. WP SuperCache is by far the most popular caching plugin. It's both entirely free and very easy to configure. We also offer caching with our DreamPress plan. Number four, use image optimization. One of the biggest drains on your site's resources is its images. They're great for making your website look amazing, but they also require server space and bandwidth. Those large file sizes have a negative effect on loading times and bandwidth usage, which harms the overall user experience on your site. Image optimization is a process that compresses the size of an image file without noticeably affecting its quality. This is easy to execute, and you can even automate the process entirely. If you'd like to optimize your images before you even upload them to your site, TinyPNG is free and super easy to use. However, there are also lots of plugins that allow you to optimize images automatically when you upload them to your WordPress site. Our favorite of these is ShortPixel. This plugin will save you plenty of bandwidth and disk space in the long run. Number five, minify and compress your site's files. Minification may sound like a pulpy sci-fi term for describing a shrink ray, but it's actually a process for making your site's code more efficient. In short, it strips away at all unnecessary content in your code to make it run faster. And if you're not experienced working directly with code, don't worry. 
We recommend using CSS Compressor or Minify, as they both feature user-friendly interfaces and produce results quickly. But for a WordPress website, the best option is usually a plugin. You have plenty of options at your disposal, but one favorite is Fast Velocity Minify. This is a free, open source, and very user-friendly tool. You can simply activate the plugin and the default settings will work wonders, but it also offers plenty of customization options for advanced users. That's it for now, but don't forget our DreamPress plans. Fully managed WordPress hosting solutions that will keep your website running with a 100% uptime guarantee. See you next time.